Welcome back to Cup Crash. Yeah, I'm Dylan. And I'm Jonathan. I'm not seeing you anymore. Oh. Marvel going, hey, can I copy your homework? And then George Lucas is like, sure, just change a few things so it's not obvious. Yeah. Uh, since you're in school right now, I don't think you can really talk about this, but people back in high school and college were vicious. Like... They'd want to copy your homework. You know what was so dumb? Like yeah. in algebra classes, people would want to like borrow your homework and all they wanted was your answers. But the teacher said all the time, if you don't show your work, you get no credit. Oh yeah, for real. Yeah. I mean, like homework, like homework uh, for me, like math in college, you know, uh, I mean, you probably use WebAssign, right? No. You didn't use WebAssign? No. Okay, I guess I was spoiled in college. I'll tell you that. But, um, yeah, you didn't even have to, like, show your work. You just put in the answer for it. Oh, really? For the homework. Yeah, you just had to, like, show your work on the test because it's just, like, homework's more for, like, practice anyway. Yeah. And then, like, on the test, it's like, okay. I mean, that would just take way too much time for a college professor just to, like, grade every homework, like, looking over every problem. I mean, it's, like, bad enough for the test. It's usually you have to wait, like, a few days like when, a week to get a test back. When I was in investments, we had one, like, your final exam was one math problem, but that math problem was, like, he gave you, like, seven sheets of paper to show your work, and he said, don't write on the back of those seven sheets, and uh, if you need more paper, just let me know, but do not write on the back. Like, what? <laughs> Seven sheets. Every every professor's got their quirks. I don't know. It's just like, okay, just don't do it this way in my class. Yeah, I think after like five uh, pages, I was done. But I walked out and I was like, I did not do this right. There's no way I did this right. <laughs> I ended up making like, uh, I think I either made a hundred on that, or I ended up making like a ninety something. Oh, that's good. Dude. Wait, yeah, what class was it? of investments, like oh. straight up investments. So as a finance major, I was like. Yes, I at least am good at one thing I studied. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, dude. Did you watch this movie? Like, I, when I watched it, I straight up thought, like, the uh, Avengers movie, the uh, Infinity War, yeah. when I saw the shields and I saw the, the, the guys having shields, yeah. I was like, this is too familiar. <laughs> yeah. And then, like, I saw this meme one day and I was like, okay, 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 yeah. okay, I got it. <laughs> I mean... It's okay, though, because they took it from a movie that not a lot of people think is good. You take that back. <laughs> oh, bro, the internet's with me on this one. I don't care, the internet. Like, I mean, I'll watch it just because I'll, like, watch anything Star Wars uh, a year or two ago. Mm-hmm. And it was just like, man, this thing does not hold up as well <laughs> from my childhood. Nah, me and my buddy Robert and some other friends, we watched it the other day, and it holds up for me. <laughs> Did it hold up for them? Oh, no, they hated it the entire time. <laughs> yeah. Or, like, they were just kind of like, we're only watching this because we have, because we plan on watching the other two. Yes, yeah, one of those things where it's like, oh, what I was doing, I wish I kept up with it, but it just got to where it was harder every year. But, like, every time, like, uh, like ever since episode seven, like, I would try and, like, watch the Star Wars movies. like Right the, before you went yeah. to the theater? Yeah, that's dope. Yeah. Just kind of like, you know, getting in that Star Wars mood. It's like, okay, it's December, it's Star Wars time. Mm -hmm. It's time to start my marathon. Yeah. <laughs> like, well, not really a marathon, more like watching a movie a day. <laughs> I love me some Starry Wars. Okay, we're going to watch all nine together, like, in one day, right? Yeah, yeah, we can totally do that, for real. One day we're not, you know, filming Cup Crash. Uh, maybe, uh... Next holiday. <laughs> Whatever holiday that is, who knows. Uh, July 4th. Oh, it's a Saturday. We're not doing that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and look at another meme. You cool? Go for it. Ah. Oh. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> and Montana cigarettes. <laughs> wow. I mean, I guess it's like post... Hannah Montana Miley, it's really on brand for her. Oh my, what if they did that, like, now, dude? Now, if they had that, like, you go to, like, the local store, and you walk in, and it's like, hello, how are you? And then you're like, can I have, um, some, uh, some, uh, Marlboros, and can I have some Hannah Montana secret, yeah. secret sticks? Oh my god. <laughs> dude. Yeah, I don't know of anyone that would be brave enough to put their face on tobacco like that. Oh, yeah. 
shh. It's like, shh, don't tell anybody I want to pack a cigarette. Oh, uh, not this one. <laughs> so, look, man, I got a master's degree in electrical engineering, all right? And then about 10 minutes later, welcome to Baskin Robbins. <laughs> I feel like the like I feel like that is true of some degrees. I find it hard to believe like electrical engineering because that's that's pretty used, right? I don't know. I don't know. I haven't looked at the job market, but like usually engineering stuff's pretty safe. But have you met engineer like do you like have you ever hung out with a lot of engineers? Like a lot of them. So like the college I went oh. to was a like engineering school. Yeah. Most of these people, when they were, like, senior year, you would talk to them and they would just be like, man, I do not want to do this when I get out. Like, four years in, they're like, this is just not what I want to do with my life. Yeah, it's kind of sucks for some people because it's like, they go into it. Well, for one thing, they make the mistake of, like, looking at the money and not, like, what they actually want to do. Yeah. And then they're like, they get so deep in and it's just like, and it's hard to turn back now. It would take, like, so long for me to, like, learn something else. I mean, it's just like, get into it, and then like maybe they do it for like a year, and then they quit because they hate it so much, and then they just end up working like a much crappier job. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I know one person, she got done with her, I think she did electrical engineering. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just thought, I was like, what kind of engineering she do? But she did electrical engineering, and now she sells houses. Uh -oh. But she sells like, like these are some like, I think, I don't, I've never asked her how much, but I look at them and I think, okay, if these were sold here compared to there, those houses are selling for either half a million to a million, some of these houses. Dang. Yeah, these houses are, like, giant looking. Some of them, now she's selling, yeah. like, other ones, but, like, she's Snapchatting the ones that she can flex on, if you know uh, what I yeah, mean. Yeah. Like, she'll be like, and it just has a, you know, so much high ceiling. Oh, and yeah. you're just like. <laughs> like, look at this castle. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, and this has got a quaint grotto in the backyard yeah. <laughs> on oh, the pool it's, area. It's so quaint. It's only, like, six million square feet. Oh, God. <laughs> but, like, uh, what happened to, like, the biomed engineer that you knew? Is she working in biomed, or? Yeah, I think she is. Okay. But I know another biomedical engineer, like, I, I think she was just like, I keep swapping between that and biomedical. Yeah, bi biomedical and uh, mechanical itself. And yeah. it's just like, she's like, mm, you know, it's just like, I don't want to. Like, it just seems like you don't want to do engineering. If you don't want to <laughs> yeah. do this and you don't want to do that, you just don't want to. No, I know three. I know another biomedical engineer. Wow. She's like straight up, I don't want to do this. She's going to get a business analytics degree, which I think is great. Yeah. That's it's actually smart. For a business student, you knew a lot of like um, engineering students. Was that. That's because you were in the, the. Yeah, it was an like, engineering school. Well, you were also in like. Um, Latino one club. Yeah, the Latino club. Yeah. And then like. I, and like also, I just made friends with like anybody. Like. And yeah. like, I don't know. You were very just, social. In yeah, college. I just didn't want to like. You always want to be around people who are, you know, fun and inviting and stuff. Oh yeah, yeah and yeah. people like yeah, engineers sure. when they're when they're like engineering students when they're out and about, they're about having fun. Like, because oh, they, yeah. they like they're like, well, when I'm home and I'm studying, that's a boring time. They're like, when I'm out and about, I want to have a good time. Oh yeah, for sure, uh, definitely. Computer people over here, lacha. Netflix, are you there? Press play to continue. Is well, that a question or a demand? Yeah, at that point. <laughs> I wish like Netflix would just admit like they're doing stuff like that. If they were really doing stuff like that, I don't know what they're doing. Yeah. But it'd be so dope if Netflix was just like <laughs> choosing moments like to some dudes just trolling people. Oh yeah, yeah. I don't know. Like, <laughs> oh, That's seriously. scary. Yeah, dude. And, like, what if you woke up, like, you out of nowhere, like, you ever been asleep, like, falling asleep, but then the TV starts making noise, and you're like, and you're trying to open your eyes so you can see if it's on so you can turn it off. Yeah. And then you're, like, looking at that, and you're like, oh, no. <laughs> God. It's like, goodbye. <laughs> Don't make this political. <laughs> <laughs> Extremely rude for Bernie to force choke Biden, <laughs> uh, in my opinion. <laughs> <laughs> Is that really my opinion? 
in my opinion. Yeah. I yeah. do not text like that anymore. <laughs> I don't know, like, uh, for some reason, like, I, don't, I didn't know what it was until I looked it up, for, but for the longest, like, in my mind, I would just go, like, if I'm honest. <laughs> if I'm, if I'm honest. Even though it makes no sense. <laughs> if, <laughs> if I am honest. I'm honest. <laughs> like, if, Oh, if that, no, honest. honest starts with an H. <laughs> yeah, it makes no sense, but that's just what my brain just autofilled oh, for some dude. reason. I mean, it fits, though. <laughs> Imagine Star Wars, if they had had this like they had the force and it's just like are you not a jedi no count dooku's just like <laughs> that's how he was like join the separatist <laughs> yeah. but you know he never actually force choked anyone oh he he did not did he, he well like except in the like pushing or like uh lightning yeah that was his thing and he didn't even do like whole hand lightning he did like three fingers hmm I never noticed that. Oh, yeah, the lightning, he was just a signature like, oh, you're messing with me? Lightning shock. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, well, bro. But these two right here, dude, I would just love, I don't know where, like, oh, yeah? Well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I think we've been goofy enough for you guys today. All right. And we will catch you next time on the next episode with different shirts, probably. Yeah, we so. don't wear this stuff too often. Yeah. Hey, this is Code Crash. If you like this episode, we post pretty much daily. And if you don't follow us on social media, the links will be down in the description. Subscribe and hit that notification bell. And catch us next time on Code Crash.